You can come to me for honesty. <clears throat> Do I have allergies or I'm coming down with something? No, this is my usual uh, sinus issue slash post-nasal drip issue that I get. This is all the usual for me. This is nothing out of the ordinary. <laughs> so for me, it's like business as usual dealing with this. <clears throat> of course, everyone out there freaking out. If you have a, as little as a sneeze or a sniffle, you're worried that you caught the coronavirus, but... <laughs> Oh, uh, I'm not too worried about that right now. Uh, this is my usual crap that I have to deal with. Right amidst all these crazy other amounts of new releases, I just don't have time to invest in a new fighting game. Um, which sucks, because I was getting good at it. Ha 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 ha! Ha 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 ha! Ha 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 I don't have time for that. I really didn't do anything for my birthday. I didn't have a cake, nothing. You know, it was very just, you know... Basically, being an adult, because when you grow up and you're an adult, you don't really celebrate your birthday anymore. I'm just saying. Um, so then this year, I was like, oh, this year will be different, man. This year, I'm going to be home. There's going to be multiple game releases. It's going to be great. And now we got, like, a fucking quarantine lockdown. <laughs> so it's like, how am I going to celebrate, right? What really sucks, honestly, is my first wedding anniversary is coming up. And, you know, last year when we got married, I wasn't able to go on a honeymoon. I couldn't afford it. Um... Which really sucked. I wanted to go on a honeymoon. I would have loved to do something with my wife, but we couldn't do it. Well, now this year, oh, maybe we could go out to a nice dinner or something. Can't do shit. Because now everything's going to be screwed up again. I'm worried about my parents. I really am. I'm really worried about my parents because, you know, they already have underlying medical conditions. And, you know, who knows what's going to happen. And apparently in Connecticut, there was only like between 100 and 200 cases of coronavirus where they live. But it doesn't mean shit, you know. They could get it. This is fucking shitty, man. <sighs> Someone just, in stream chat just said, and taxes got pushed back this year, so it's good for you. It's not good for me at all. It doesn't affect me at all. I've already, I've already, uh, have, well, my taxes are already in the process of being filed. I already was in the process of doing it before it was announced that anything was delayed. And <clears throat> I'm already on a payment plan for my taxes. So all that's going to happen is my payment plan for my taxes is going to continue. Uh, that's it. Pushing back the taxes doesn't affect me at all. Nothing. Zero. No positive benefit whatsoever. 100% salt. It tasted like someone took a salt shaker and opened the top and went, just poured it all over the fucking pizza. In Doom Eternal, because the way they set it up is just do one of three finishers to regain whatever you don't have and then just keep going, it just seems kind of like it's an endless pattern. And even though, yes, okay, you unlock new weapons. Absolutely. You unlock some new abilities. Absolutely. It's just a means to an end. <clears throat> you know what I'm saying? It's just, an ex it's just another excuse to keep the combat going. Oh, so now you have two more weapons. So that means you have two more kinds of ammo. So the combat can keep going for a while longer before you have to use the chainsaw to get your ammo back and then just start the whole process over again. But I'm not necessarily ex uh, thinking that's good. You know what I mean? Like, it's different, but is it as good... As previous iterations, especially even just in this franchise. I don't know. I don't know. So I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just kind of like shrugging a little bit. I Like I said, I've played it twice. I'm kind of like, nah. It, 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 to me, I'm getting bored of the combat. Like I said, I'm actually liking the world design. When there's a new enemy introduced, that's kind of neat. The, 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 the art and the music, the music is outstanding, right? You get some cool plot development or maybe a boss or whatever. All right, that's kind of neat. But then it's like, okay, another room full of repetitive enemies is doing the same thing over and over. Another room full of repetitive enemies doing the same thing over and over. It doesn't ha feel meaningful. Well then. What? It didn't work. I went to jump and it didn't do the first jump. It only did the double jump in midair. That's stupid. That was the opposite of fun. Like, seriously, like, I understand. Oh, I'm so adrenaline fueled, bro. Oh, oh, look, I got a chainsaw, bro. I killed them all, and then I did a killer kill, yo. And now I get my armor. Yo, yo, yo. There's like no, there's no order to it. It's just chaotic, a chaotic, repetitive circle of do one, then do the other, then do one, then do the other, then do one, then do the other. With endless amounts of enemies just spawning all around you, with no explanation as to where they're coming from, why they're coming in like that. Like, I don't know, man. I really don't know. I, I know some people love this game. I'm actually not liking it as much as the last one. And by the way, it's really not even in the spirit of Doom, because old Dooms aren't like that. Old Dooms, you know, you gotta plan carefully and go in there and do stuff, and in this it's more like, 
well, just do the pattern. Just keep doing that chaotic pattern over and over and over. And I'm like, I don't know, dude. <laughs> what? I don't know what's going on. Dude, a cat could even spawn on my body. How is that fair? Um, the one thing I absolutely have to do tomorrow is I have to get up early in the morning. And I have to go grocery shopping for the week. Okay? Um, it sucks that I have to do it. You know? Because normally I'd, you know... Grocery shopping is something that I would do during a fun day out with my wife. Now, because of the situation we're in, everything's closed. Really, it's just a necessary evil at this point. I'm going to be basically ordering out food for delivery here because you can't go to eat at a restaurant. And there's really nothing else to do. Everything is closed up. I know, on my day off, let's do house cleaning, right? But what are you going to do? You're stuck at home all day. Am I doing anything special for my birthday? I'll be honest with you guys, probably not. Because I'm probably going to be working my butt off um, with everything going on right now. <coughs> Not only, you know, the stuff in the real world, but also the, all these new releases and everything that I'm trying to juggle at the same time. Um, so, more than likely, I'm going to be here on my birthday. Wow. Will I be doing anything to actually celebrate my birthday? I seriously doubt it. More than likely, I'll just be working my butt off. And How old am I turning this year? Uh, 77. <laughs> no. I think I'm turning 38. I think. <laughs> I think. Wait, what? I, I I hope. I hope that I remember my age. That would be pretty bad if I don't, but I would, couldn't even tell you. At this point, with the way things are going, I couldn't even tell you. I will put on the cowboy hat. <laughs> as stupid as that sounds, I will do those things if you guys are supportive today on the stream. All right? So those are just bonus goals I'm throwing out there. I've, like I said, I've been doing these on the late streams. For some reason, people really seem to like it. I haven't seen any other streamer play on a lower difficulty like you do. I'm not playing on a lower difficulty. I'm playing on the default difficulty. Anyone who says I'm playing on a lower difficulty is a liar and is misinformed because what they're trying to do is say that my stream sucks or my playthrough sucks, like always. And it doesn't matter what difficulty I play on, I'm told it's still not good enough. <clears throat> you remember I played Resident Evil 2 Remake on the hardest difficulty possible and people still fucking complain. So, it doesn't matter what I play on. They'll complain regardless. Um, in regards to the difficulty I'm playing, I believe it's Hurt Me Plenty. That has always been the default difficulty for Doom games, and that's what I'm playing on. So you are completely incorrect, Conway Bloodbank, in what you're saying right now. People like Con Conway Bloodbank are not here to enjoy a chill stream. They're here because they want me to suffer, and they want to basically make fun of me and deride me constantly, and point a finger and say, ha ha, Phil died a million times. I'm not playing your game, because I'm not a fucking idiot. I wasn't born yesterday. I know what you're doing, because I'm not stupid. I don't appreciate it. It's very immature. You don't get to direct my content and tell me how to play a game. I do. And people are enjoying the playthrough as it is now. Everyone's freaking out. Because the thing is, everyone's spoiling the game, because everyone's already fucking played it or watched someone else play it. So they're like, oh, there's a tough boss in the castle. I wish Phil would just fight the boss, go to the boss, go to the boss. I want to explore the game like every other Dark Souls game and have fun with it and find the items and shit. I don't want to fucking wait, you know, rush to the tough boss for your fucking personal satisfaction because you're a fucking sadistic bastard and you want to see me suffer. I'm going to fight the fucking boss eventually, but I also want to find all the items and stuff. So fucking relax. Good lord, fucking people. So if you have a problem with that, go watch someone else play a master level run of the game on the highest difficulty and enjoy yourself. You don't have to be here watching my content. Trust me, the people who want to sit here and whine when you're gone, it'll still be just as entertaining content and there'll still be more than enough people to watch and enjoy the content. We won't miss you. So if that is your point, if you're, I want to sit here and just complain constantly. Get the fuck out right now because you're wasting your time and you're wasting everyone else's time and we don't care about you. All right? I'm just being honest. If that's your agenda, you're in the wrong place. Leave and come back when you're ready to actually have some fun. Because that's what the stream's supposed to be. Not torture Phil and laugh at his misfortune because I'm a, a psychopath negative dick. Instead, it should be, oh, I actually want to see Phil have fun with the game today and have some interaction with him. All right? So maybe you've got the wrong impression. This is not the Phil tortures himself stream. And if you're looking for that, this is the wrong place. Thank you for the cheer, but you're completely misguided. And the things you said in your cheer are completely factually incorrect. And so, of course, then Conway Bloodbank insults me in the stream chat. And says, he, oh, oh, I can't believe you said that to me. I'll take my money elsewhere. You're right, you will, because you're now you're banned. You're absolutely right. You will go elsewhere, because you're not coming back here. <laughs> your 50-bit cheer, 
to basically try to insult me and derail the stream and make me torture myself was received. I understand your agenda, and you can get the fuck out like I told you to. You're absolutely right. In 2017, my life was tumultuous. I had many negative things going on in the background of my life, some of which you guys know about, some of which you don't know about, that were essentially making my life a living hell. Um, I didn't know what was going to happen in regards to my future uh, as a content creator. I didn't know what was going to happen in regards to my future as a human being, quite frankly. I didn't know what that was going to happen just in general, uh, you know, <clears throat> and it scared me. And I remember feeling pretty bad about a lot of things going on in my life back then, just being very honest. Yes, I did tell everyone that if the, the tips goal tonight is reached, I will be putting on the vest tonight, okay, like we've done the last couple of Minecraft streams. Wish you did, we'd have to donate for you to pay attention to our comments. You don't. You don't at all. I read the stream chat frequently during my Minecraft streams. It's just that those who uh, who contribute are going to get priority because I have to give everyone a shout-out who contributes. But I frequently talk to people during my Minecraft streams, and it doesn't have to be contribution-related whatsoever, so you don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Chunky Jack, it is not true that I only talk to you when you cheer. You're a liar. I'm talking to you right now, and you did not cheer. All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tell you something. I'm probably in no way, shape, or form in any way of any mindset anywhere near wings. All right? I'm probably the furthest thing. Like, whatever he says that sounds so stupid or ludicrous, just imagine that I'm saying the exact polar opposite of that. And I think you're probably... You'll hit the nail right on the head. Okay? If we hit the tips goal tonight, I will put on the vest. All right? Um, Una Virgo Totota. Cousins vended 100 bit cheers. I thought you don't do gimmicks. Why are you doing the vest thing now? Because people like it. I don't... You're right. I'm not going to do silly things that have nothing to do with my content. But it just so happens the vest does have to do with my content. Is that the bird statue? There it is. The vest does have to do with my content. It's a vest that I used to wear in old vlogs. It's not intrusive upon my content. It doesn't hinder the content. If anything, it's just something silly that seems to be motivating people to want to, to reach a goal, to contribute, and help me out. So we'll keep doing it. There's no reason not to. Rock the Eyes Cheers. So how many bits for you to do the Kiki Challenge? I have no idea what you're talking about, and I don't do silly challenges. So... Give me back that filet of fish. Give me that fish. Remember that song? I think he was saying, Give me back my filet of fish. Give me that fish. So you want to know the truth, guys? Here's the truth. The reason that you got a few people who seem to be complaining about the vest. Oh, Phil, why are you doing that? Isn't that a gimmick? Here's why they're complaining. Because people found something positive about myself and my content that's silly and fun and they like it. And it's, a, it's making people feel motivated to contribute. People have been contributing recently. Because they want us to be put on this silly vest and, you know, have fun on a stream in it. So, because of that, the trolls hate it. Why? Oh my god, Phil found something positive and silly that people like and people are actually contributing and supporting him? Oh, that's horrible. We gotta just make fun of that constantly and say that it's bad, 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 right? Because that's what they do. Because if something works, they've got to try to tear it down and make it seem like it's bad, bad, bad. Because they're jealous, because they're nervous. It's just another way that I get support, right? So... That's what's going on. Don't worry about these dumb asses and what they say and do. I don't. Uh, I will continue to do what's fun. And if you guys tell me you like something, I'll do it, regardless of what these morons say. So don't worry about that. Wearing a mask will stop others from getting sick from you. Because it holds back when you cough. But it doesn't prevent anything that's in the air from getting into your nose. Do you understand? So it's worthless. If you're trying to stay healthy, it's worthless. If you're already sick then you should be wearing the mask. So literally every person you see wearing a mask out is an idiot because they don't know how they work. I am not a cartoon character. I'm not a fucking Muppet. I am a human. I act like myself. And every once in a while, do I have a reaction where I'm like over the top? Sure, because every human has that every once in a while. Beams by wearing a vest for re reaching a, a goal. Uh, no, at all, not at all. And if you think that, you're a fucking idiot. You don't know the difference because you're you're a moron. You're just stretching really, really, really desperately to try to say that I'm a hypocrite. I'm not. You're just stupid, and you can go fuck yourself. Sorry, I'm trying to ha handle an asshole here. I took care of it. Well, una vergototota. Hold on. I gotta take of an, another. Take care of another idiot. There we go. Doctor Mike Hunt. Har har har. Timmy Dodge, you feeling all right? You seem extra annoyed and tense. I'm not extra annoyed and tense at all. Only when idiots say that do I do I get tense, though. So, uh, no. Cat loves playing Animal Crossing. She's been playing it, and she run into a ton of impasses where 
my character has to do something so menial. Like, for example, my character has to be the one to hand wood and iron ingots to a Nook uh, sibling so that they will build the shop. Do, do you think Cat's going to wait till Thursday? Of course not. I'm not playing Animal Crossing yet till Thursday. I don't want to waste all that time when she's playing. So she's been doing this stuff behind the scenes. All the boring, menial stuff that's not going to be fun to watch on stream. It should be neat. It should be fun to have my wife playing it during the week when I'm not. And then maybe twice a week jumping in to see what she's improved on the island, what's been added. And just kind of doing relaxing stuff when I can a couple times a week. I just want to have fun with the game. How do you have fun with a game that everything kills you in one hit? You know, it's like fucking stupid. That was bullshit. I'm sorry. I, and I hate that that keeps happening. Oh, enemies are spawning on your body. There's nothing you can do about it. Take insane no damage. Wait, what? How is that my fault? That's not fair. I cleared the room. I was doing well. Oh, Kakadi was biting your ass. Protection 4, Silk Touch, Efficiency 4, Multi-Shot 1, and Channeling 1. What the fuck kind of mess is that? It's time for the vest. The vest is best and it has returned. Excuse me. That was disgusting. Oh, man. Oh, I'll be blunt. People fill your shit on other streamers for doing similar things. That's possibly why. No, not similar things. I shit on other streamers for purposely trying to act like a cartoon character. If you dye your hair in neon color. PP Pants Boy sent me $3 and your beard is weird. Well, thanks, dude. You're a weirdo, too. <laughs> if you're constantly going, ah, or whoa, and talking in a high-pitched kitty voice to attract children to your fucking streams, that's disgusting behavior. And that is something that I will never, ever condone. All right? Oh, shit! Ah! My legs! Oh, shit! Ah!